To select the subject in After Effects, we can use the Pen tool. Apart from using that tool, we can use Roto Brush tool. If we want to use it, first activate the Roto Brush in the Tools section. If it's active, double click on the source file to bring up the video preview on the file. From the video source file layer view, we can select the subject area using Roto Brush. To use this tool, brush over the subject area you want to select. This tool will select the subject automatically in the marked area. The function of this tool is similar to the selection tool in Photoshop. If there are areas on the subject that haven't been selected, brush again using Roto Brush tool. To reduce access selection areas, brush over those areas while holding down Alt key. To see the different preview modes, just select the available preview features. To change the color of the line in the selected area, we can choose the color from the alpha boundary. Just choose the color you want to use. In toggle alpha overlay, we can see which areas have been selected. Here, there's a warning telling me that I'm not using it in full resolution mode. To fix the problem, change the resolution and playback resolution section of the project sequence. And now the warning has disappeared. Similarly, when we use the pen tool, we also have to check the selected area from frame to frame. If there are subject areas that have not been selected correctly, brush again on those areas. If the subject is selected in every frame, click freeze to lock it. This process will be long if using many frames. For the results, we can see through the project sequence view. Apart from Roto Brush tool, there is the Refine Edge tool. This tool is useful for disguising areas on the sides of the subject. Go to the source video file view. Because it is still in freeze mode, this tool cannot be used. We have to unfreeze first if in freeze mode. To use it, activate Refine Edge tool. Once the Refine Edge tool is active, brush the inner areas of the subject first, and then mark the outer area of the subject. And the result will look like this. The edges of the subject marked with Refine Edge will appear faded. That's how to use Roto Brush and Refine Edge tool in Adobe After Effects. Thank you for watching, and see you again in an or video.